It's time we took back control. President Trump can't silence me. Sadiq Khan has given the green or should that be the orange light for a giant inflatable Trump baby to fly over London. There's thousands and thousands of people protesting peacefully. <laughs> We heard that Sadiq Khan was visiting this cafe and we are very local residents in this network of streets behind us and we really want to engage with him to talk about some of the issues with the LTN which has been imposed on our area and the displaced traffic that it's causing and we feel it's very socially aggressive as well really and it hasn't been, there's no proper open clear consultation on it as well. Are you surprised he's not come out to talk to you? Well, yeah, we're very disappointed because we didn't really feel we, we, we looked like a threatening mob and um, we just wanted to ask some questions and it's all been about stage managed photo opportunities from what we can tell and he's been held up in, in the cafe with the door being held shut uh -huh. so it's been a bit odd. How much of a problem is the LTN causing you? It's, it's uh, really going forward we're worried because the economy hasn't properly opened up in London yet and it's already causing a lot of problems because now our only entry access, access route is by the North Circular and any problem on there we are pretty much landlocked and, uh, and, it, and it's causing a lot of displaced traffic for other people around us. It's very quiet for us ourselves but just a few streets away we know people are choking. What do you want to tell City? We just want to say, we just want to, to communicate that uh, We're not happy. things aren't being, being openly, openly no, debated and no, um, no, no due process being followed basically. And, our, um, our council leader won't listen to us. He won't. The, the lead sponsor of the scheme is the deputy councillor, the deputy leader of the Enfield Council and he only engages through closed groups uh, which aren't allowed to be recorded or shared and we just want some proper, we just want democracy in action. Above anything I'm a democrat and I want to see due process followed and uh, it's no good hiding behind Covid to not engage with people. Sadiq, will you talk to us? Sadiq, this is LTN. It's very socially regressive and it's killing people with the air pollution. Sadiq, why won't you talk to us? Sadiq, please talk to us. We're just a few residents. Sadiq, please talk to us. Sadiq, Sadiq, can we not talk while we walk? Sadiq, please talk to us. Sadiq, this LTN is causing so much bad air around the area, it's socially aggressive. You're forcing people into North Turkey where you're building 20 storey towers housing some of the most vulnerable people in the borough. Sadiq, can you listen? Please listen. Sadiq, Sadiq, do we get any engagement? Sadiq, Sadiq, can you talk to us? Supposed to be a democracy. Sadiq, I would have expected a hybrid at least. Um, okay, that's it, is it? So he's not. So this is the mayor of London. He's just done a photo op. He hasn't engaged with us at all. Few residents wanting to express some problems in the area, and he's just driven off and no engagement. Okay.
Thank you. What do you think of that? Well, it's just very disappointing. You know, we live in a democracy and this is this is really not good enough. He's, 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 he's come here for our vote, I would have thought. And there's no, um, there's no engagement with us at all. It was just a photo opportunity and that was it. You? Yeah. You would have thought. It was just a photo opportunity.